as I said before, we're, we're standing in Rothschild Hill Boulevard. Uh, you're going to learn, so I'm not going to tell you too much before you see the film. Just a bit of an introduction. But the original vision of Tel Aviv was that it was going to be like a little garden village with boulevards and beautiful houses. And everybody would have their own little garden around it. And um, it would be a very expansive village. Uh, the vision changed rather dramatically because uh, even though Tel Aviv was established in 1909, already in 1914 there was the eruption of the First World War. Many of the Jewish residents who were believed by the Tur Turks to be supporters of the British were deported to Egypt and other places. The period during the First World War was a very difficult period here. After the First World War, the British arrived and Tel Aviv started to rebuild again the immigration laws to Palestine, as it was called before 1948, were relaxed somewhat and Jewish immigrants started fleeing to Palestine from various sites in Eastern Europe as a result of pogroms. And so this ideal garden village that was supposed to have been built suddenly had to accommodate large influxes of population and it coincides as well with this period of the Bauhaus development, these sort of small economically Soviet style houses that were starting to be built. They looked like Soviet houses, they were very economical accommodation. So the, the wide boulevard, some of them stayed and some of them disappeared under housing development. Um, this square itself is known as the square from the founders of Tel Aviv because it's really it's the central Tel Aviv where we're standing right now. Um, this plot that we see here, they're using a verse taken out of the book of Jeremiah 31. So it's chapter 31, verse 3. And uh, I'll give it my rough translation because I don't have the King James in my head. But it says, oh, I will, still I will build and will be built in the sands of Israel. That's the meaning of the verse here, Israel, at the end. And um, 